job training programs are good for both the economy and the environment. They are vital to building a sustainable energy future, growing careers in clean industries, and putting Americans back to work. Salvation for any race, nation, or culture must come from within. It is our responsibility to create opportunities for those who have not been as, as blessed as we are. For those who have succeeded and overcome obstacles, it is our responsibility to go back and help those who have stumbled and faced ongoing obstacles in, in communities in which we live and serve every day. I was underqualified. Uh, even though I had some education, I had no certifications. And with this program, oh, I'm getting OSHA certified, which I've been finding was a big roadblock for me. The Breaking the Chains of Poverty uh, Workforce Development Model is a two-segment, 28-day, six-week program that focuses on working with underemployed and unemployed segments of our community in an effort to make them more employable and to build relationships with employers and collaborative partners to reduce long-term poverty in underserved communities. I think a lot of people, you know, should have this opportunity to get involved in programs, whether they hear it works or it don't work. You know, do it for yourself. Commit yourself to one thing. And I committed myself to working and being a family. And this job and green jobs and recycling has, you know, led me to that path and I'm happy about it. I go home, I smile, I got a job, and I just thank everybody who was a part of my life the last 27 months. My name is Aisha Dorsey. I am the owner and co-founder of Lifeline Environmental. It's an environmental abatement company. We specialize in lead abatement, mold, asbestos abatement. Um, oil recovery and lab packing. I was always interested in creating a path that was very varying from day to day, included office work, included you know managerial duties, included working with different groups and once I put that all together it was oh I want to own my own business <laughs> and I came across Civic Works and Civic Works had their environmental certification program so I said, hmm, this sounds along the lines that you know, I'm looking for. Without that, I wouldn't have those options available to me. I took the certifications and I started my own business. So that's something that I feel Civic Works aids in. They aid in community development and as well as job creation. Because I can now, I can now provide jobs for my community. Recycle Force is an end-of-life recycler. We've gone now that we're processing over 600,000 pounds of material per month. The green economy is ideally suited as a re-entry vehicle for people coming home who've made a mistake, who need a second chance. Uh, I've been here for three years now. I was asked to stay on permanently to help with the training and the quality control here. I've been off probation completely for, I think, over a year now. Um, and the opportunity I got from Recycle Force uh, gave me the confidence to move forward in my life. This is as long as I have worked a job, you know what I'm saying? I'm just going to use the fast money, so this is, a, this is a new transition for me. I don't mind cleaning up the neighborhood, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, the neighborhood I came from, is, it's a drug infested, so therefore, cleaning up, it's good. We need to put people to work. Do not cut training dollars, because without training, you're not going to get hired. WDC Solar has been in business for three years. Uh, we have seven employees installing solar panels on residential, commercial, and uh, have a couple of utility scale projects in the works. So we want to get a group of men and women who are interested in working, who are hungry for a job, We'll get them in, we'll train them, uh, and then we'll put them to work. Environmental stewardship has always been a part of my life, I think. Um, so I think that's the number one um, factor on why I got into this industry. My boss now, Mr. Davis, said he came in, said he was looking for people that's willing to work, willing to find out, learn some new educated training for free. Once I learned it was about solar, knowing how fascinating that I am with all type of science and electricity, me and myself, I was like, okay, I definitely want to learn hands-on things I can do because I know this can definitely help me out in the future. 
dreams come true. You just have to continue to work very hard, stay focused, and be patient. The success of job training programs in preparing workers hinges on continued federal investment dollars. We need your voice in letting our leaders know that job training programs are making a huge difference. A strong workforce ensures a strong economy, and a strong economy means a strong America.